Just tell me. Is this going to be your prop for the episode? You're going to be drinking it? Oh, no. <laughs> now I can't do it. <laughs> you have to wait for it to dry. Damn it! <laughs> Hi, how are you? I'm doing great. Good, cool. Do you so, want to know why I'm doing so great? Why are you doing so great, Lindsay? I'm doing so great because I heard some really, really, really amazing news about you. Me? Yes. Oh, that's so awesome. Yeah. It's did all you true. hear about it yet? Yes, I did. You did? Um, the Nobel Prize was announced. Oh, you're doing no. something? Oh, yeah, uh, no, yeah, no, something what? else. Oh, yeah. what? That you have a new book coming I out. Do. Uh, it's my second book will be published by Jimmy Patterson. Uh, at Little Brown, which is part of Hachette, um, and it's called, it's, the title is tentative, right now it's called Night Flight, it's a comedic thriller about a gay teen who gets caught up in this Hitchcockian um, sort of case of mistaken identity and gets chased by cyber terrorists uh, um, as part of this uh, terrorist organization, the Swans, and he goes under, he goes on, he goes, during his spring break, he goes on the run from them while he's, you know, figuring out who he is and his identity, which is actually in flux, because um, it's sort of been stolen. <laughs> That's uh, awesome! Yes. Congratulations! You. It'll be out um, spring, I think spring 2019, it's about a year. Nice, mark your calendars, it's so exciting! Oh my gosh! Wait, Jimmy Patterson as in... James Patterson, yes. the prolific uh, yes. novelist. James yeah. Patterson is very involved in this imprint. Wow. Uh, and obviously, since he sold like two gazillion books, uh, has a very, very uh, clear understanding of like packaging I and bet. titles. And, and so, you know, it's, it's a great thing to like have to have that phone call or email where it's like, James Patterson liked your book. He really liked your book. Like, <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? Can't wait to pick it up in approximately 365 days. Yay! Yeah! Yay! You're such a prolific novelist now. You have so many books coming out. I'm shooting like, out one a week. <laughs> just like James Patterson. Yes. My question for you is, I've got a lot of events coming up to promote my book someday somewhere. Get it in bookstores. Um, and I am doing these panels and I'm doing all of these bookstore uh, events and I just get so nervous because there's all these other writers and they're all like, some of them are like bestsellers and I'm brand new to this. And I'm just wondering, what can I do to really make an impression and, and really hold my own in these panels? Well, you have to do spit takes. Like, um, it's really the only way, like, let's say you're on a panel with like, I don't know, E. Lockhart or Jonathan Franzen or mm -hmm. Toni Morrison. Yeah. And you have to like engage. Uh -huh. So I found that like spit takes when I say something really impressive mm -hmm. really does the trick in terms of like standing your ground at that panel. Okay. And that's something all I found right. really useful when I've been at these panels, all the ones I've done, which are tons. Yeah. Yeah. So like I don't know, like you'll have the yeah, water. Yeah, can you help me? All right, so like what's like what's the topic that we're talking okay. about? Okay. Well let's say we're talking about um um horse racing because there's, you know, this really iconic horse racing scene in Toni Morrison's next book, and so I'm asking... Well, all right, pretend you're Jonathan Franz. Okay, so you're me. I'm you. I'm yeah, I'm like, Jonathan Hi, Lindsay, Franzen. Someday Somewhere is coming out okay. uh, in, in the spring. And then I'm Jonathan Franz. Yeah, you can be Jonathan Franz, but okay. I'll be you. Okay. Uh, it's just, I'll show you how well it works. Okay. Wait, what am I talking about? <laughs> <laughs> well, something that John, like something about have you read what what John the correction yeah something some some maybe he like has a revelation about his writing process or okay. something about the book okay then as I was deciding that my family patriarch was going to slowly disintegrate <laughs> what? <laughs> what what he was gonna do that what. See, this is this is the perfect. Oh my god! This is the perfect way, and now all the attention is on you, and you can talk about someday somewhere. <laughs> it's not the spring. That's it. See, you didn't see it coming. No one saw it coming. This is how you do the panels. I get. I mean, that's really going to get everyone's attention. That's for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, yeah. That's that was great. Um, Thanks, Derek, for teaching me about um, how to really make a splash on a panel. That's good. Yeah. See, see what uh -huh. it did? You got all, uh, now, now you're all, all sharp-witted, Yeah. ready to go. Ugh. Well, um, if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. And uh, yeah, you can get Derek's book, Scream All Night, coming very soon in July. And uh, his new book. Night Flight. Yep, yeah, Night Flight, which coming out soon. Tentative title. And Lindsay's book, Someday Somewhere, which I just, I have to say, it's one of the most beautiful YA books I've read in a really long time. It's a heartbreaking, beautiful, touching, 
engrossing, captivating story um, someday somewhere coming uh, in June. Uh, it's actually coming in April. <laughs> it's not June?